Once the publication has been created and the business information added, each element can be individually formatted. You can change the way the font displays by modifying the color, the type, the size, as well as the location. You can use the Format Painter option to apply the exact same formatting to multiple areas without having to go through each individual step redundantly. Once complete, you can choose specific printing options such as the number of copies to be made, the margins, as well as the page orientation before you choose to print. Ensure you have the print business card open in your publication window. Then choose a text box and select all of the contents that are in it. Once you've selected all of your text, take a couple of minutes to kind of play around and modify your text by working with the formatting toolbar. and ensure your cursor is placed between the font that you want to apply. On the standard toolbar, select the Format Painter tool. Then, click and select the entire text that you wish to apply the formatting to. When you release your mouse, the same formatting from the originally selected text should be applied to this new text. All right, and once your business cards are all done, there is just one step until you can hand them out. That's to print them. How to prepare your publications for print at a commercial business will be covered in a later module. For now, to print out your business card from a basic home printer, we're going to first set our margin. To do this, first select your file menu, then select page setup. In the Page Setup dialog box, first ensure that you have the correct size for the business card selected towards the bottom of the window. Then, on the right under Margin Guides, enter the desired dimensions for the page that the cards will be printed on. Select the OK button to apply the changes to your current publication. Then, to modify the actual printing options, Select the File menu again. This time, select the Print option. In this Print dialog box, you can choose to print multiple business cards per page or simply print one per page. Also, choose the size of paper you will print on by using the Paper Size drop-down list. Dictate the orientation of the sheet of paper as well as how far apart the actual cards will be from one another on the printed sheet. Then, also choose the number of copies you want to print, but keep in mind this copies refers to how many pages you would like to print. In saying that, if you have, let's say, eight cards per page, you must multiply the number of copies by eight to determine how many cards will be printed. To actually print the cards out, first ensure you have the correct type of paper put in your printer, then select the print button. 